Happy is an emotion, and like any other emotion, it is triggered by something that is important to you. Although there are many paths to happy, which we're going to discuss in a moment, the two paths that we most often use, especially in commercials, is pleasure and excitement. And in this Hershey spot, we see both. We see that we have the eyes widening in excitement. We also have the eyelids relaxing in pleasure. For the on-camera actor, especially in commercial work, understanding happy and knowing how to consistently and truthfully produce on demand will be a key factor to your success. Okay, so what we're going to cover in this video is the emotion of happy. We're going to be talking about the triggers, the sensations, the impulses. I'm also going to uh, share with you the family and the key words that might imply that a happy or joyful feeling. Then we're going to take a look at your take on this emotion. All right, so let's first start with the muscle groups. Okay, so there's three areas that uh, are involved when we are genuinely happy. For the mouth, the corners of the lips are drawn back and up, and again, that's that zygote major muscle group. And the mouth may or may not be open, it depends. Now with the cheeks, they're raised and that fold that runs from the nose to the corner of your mouth is more pronounced. That's because of that lifting of the lip corners. The eyes, the lids are relaxed and wrinkles will form below the eyes as well as in the corners. For the purpose of us all speaking the same emotional language, when all the muscle groups of happy are activated and symmetrical, we're going to call this expression full happy. However, when we expand, lift, tense, all the muscle groups to the very max, that's going to be the, the biggest recognizable reaction of happy you can get. Happy covers all the positive emotions from sensory pleasures, amusement, and contentment to pride and accomplishment and so on. Although happy is the most recognizable of all the emotions, it's often the most difficult to create and sustain for on-camera actors. What I often notice is when an actor is given the direction to be happy, he or she immediately produces a big smile, which seems like a no-brainer, right? Not so fast. Although happy is recognized by a smile, a smile for many reasons a lot of which aren't really due to happiness. For example, we break the ice with a polite smile, we hide frustrations, embarrassments, and fears, or show submissiveness with a smile. Often we smile because it's just, it's just easier than saying, I don't care. What I want you to understand here is that a smile does not always result from being happy. You know, it doesn't mean that that big grin you're gonna put on will have any impact on the viewer. To get the proper intensity to be able to sustain this emotion, you will need to know exactly why you're happy. Let's look at the triggers for happy. According to most researchers, goal attainment is the most universal trigger. Here's the thing, having your needs met by others or achieving a personal goal you set for yourself can trigger a happy response. The more intense the need, the challenge, the more intense the happy experience is likely to be. But there are some other paths to happy that we're gonna uh, go into more detail a little bit later when we begin to explore your triggers. But for now, those other paths include sensory pleasures, relief, excitement, self-concept, amusement, uh, another suffering, also, you know, when you think about it, fun can lead us to having happy feelings. Let's look at the sensations. Depending on the triggers, anything from an overall sense of well-being to feeling light or relaxed. Most people really enjoy the happy sensations. With the impulses, when you're happy, what you want, you want more of what's making you happy. There is also an impulse to get closer to the source. You may also want to laugh, giggle, or even snort, depending on the trigger. When we talk about the family and key words that may be used to describe a happy experience, there are many words related to, to this, uh, such as contentment, wonderment, amusement, pleasure, joy, glee, or delight, to name a few. Let's talk about your take. Is happy your go-to emotion? Do you always have a smile on your face? Is it easy for you to express happiness, or do you often contain it? Almost Everyone enjoys the sensations of a happy experience, but there are those who've learned from the experience not to trust these feelings. For some, happy feelings may also trigger guilt or anxiety. Many have learned to control their happy expression because they don't like their smile or sharing positive feelings makes them too vulnerable. What's your take? Understanding your relationship with happy is key to seeing it material, hearing it in directions, and executing it appropriately. 
All right, so that's your quick overview on the emotion of happy. I suggest to get a more in-depth look at this emotion, read through the material that I put up there. Because there's a lot to talk about when it comes to happy, I've created an additional video on the genuine smile that after you're done with this, you can take a look at. All right, so that's it for happy.